Welcome to the Joy of Music. My name is Diane Bish, and I would like to invite you to join us today for a program entitled, A Musical Journey of the Czech Republic, with music from great churches and cathedrals of this beautiful country. On our musical journey of the Czech Republic, we begin in the town of Kutna Hora, a one-hour drive from Prague, the capital of the Czech Republic. St. Barbara's Church in Kutna Hora is one of the most famous Gothic churches in Central Europe and is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. St. Barbara is the patron saint of miners, which was highly appropriate for a town whose wealth was based entirely upon its silver mines. Construction began in 1388 of the great St. Barbara Church, but because work on the church was interrupted several times, it was not completed until 1905. There is an amazing chapel in Kutnahora called the Bone Church, known as the Chapel of All Saints. When a handful of earth from the Holy Land was sprinkled over the surrounding graveyard, the chapel shot to stardom as the hippest resting place for the rich and famous. As war and plague came and went, the new burials outgrew the space available and the older bones were removed and stored in the crypt 
of the chapel. The outside appearance of the St. Barbara Church in Kutna Hora is fascinating. Originally, there were eight radial chapels. Later on, the choir was constructed, supported by double-arched flying buttresses. Internal points of note are the glass windows, the altars, pulpits, and choir stalls, and of course, the great organ. From Kutnahora, we travel to Prague, the capital and most famous city of the Czech Republic, situated on the Vitava River. We play the great organ of the St. Jacob's Church of Prague.
Prague is a magical city of bridges, cathedrals, gold-tipped towers, and church domes, all found along the Vltava River, which flows through the city. The picturesque medieval center is a mixture of cathedrals, countless church towers, cobble streets, and walled courtyards. Overlooking Prague on a high hill is the 9th century castle and St. Vitus Cathedral.
From Prague, we travel on to Chesky Krumlov, an ancient town in the Czech Republic, surrounded by walls, towers, and castles. Construction of the town and castle began in the late 13th century at a ford in the Vltava River, which was important in trade routes in Bohemia. Over the many hundreds of years, the town has grown and expanded, with most of the architecture dating from the 14th through the 17th centuries. The core of the old town is within a horseshoe bend of the river, with the old neighborhood and castle on the other side of the Vltava River. We're here in Chesky Krumlov in the middle of winter in the Minor Brothers Monastery or known as the Minaret Monastery here in Chesky. It is very ancient and the organ of the chapel dates back to the 1600s. My name is Diane Bish, and I would like to thank you for joining us today as we have brought you a program of music from the historic churches and cathedrals of the Czech Republic. We thank you for joining us, and we look forward to seeing you again next week on The Joy of Music.